So choosing a pesticide to use in the garden can be a daunting task when you consider how many options you may have. The important things to understand is what type of pest you're trying to treat and matching the product to the pest. So if I would like to kill dandelions in my lawn, I'm going to look for an herbicide. Now it's very important also to read the labels carefully on any pesticide product that you buy. The labels are going to list the active ingredients, they're going to list what types of pests this particular compound will work on, uh, how to use it safely, how much to use and when to use it, and how to dispose of the empty container. So those are all the very important things that will be contained on the label. If I would like to treat downy mildew in my garden, then I'm going to need to get a fungicide. And I'll need to read that label carefully to ensure that it will treat the fungal pathogen that I am looking for. And um, again, the label will tell me how to use it safely and when to apply it. If I want to kill aphids or flea beetles in my garden, I'll need to pick an insecticide that works specifically on those insects. There are many different brands of pesticides available. The important thing is to read the label carefully match the product to your need and follow the label instructions. And if you do that, then you will have effective pest control in your garden. From the University of Wyoming Extension, I'm Caitlin Youngquist, you're watching From the Ground Up.